Good morning, America. This is Mike, the news reporter, coming in live from Tell You News to discuss the upcoming presidential race between Stephen King and Adam Sandler. Now, it turns out this election might as well already be over, folks. While Stephen King's national standing has been at an abysmal 2% ever since he announced his candidacy, Adam Sandler has been maintaining a whopping 86% for several months now. It's worth noting that while a few presidents throughout history have won the election without the majority of public approval, this would be the first time ever that a candidate has won with such a low approval rating. Another reason why Sandler seems to be the next choice for president is the candidate's choice of vice presidents. While Sandler has chosen to go with the safe choice of Kobe Bryant, given his new standing as the mayor of Chicago, King has opted to go with Mickey Mouse. That's right, and I don't know about you, but it turns out that not a single candidate has ever been elected with a fictitious Disney character as their running mate. In fact, it turns out that, as the predictions stand, the Electoral College seems to be looking at about 534 going in the way of Sandler, and only four coming from his own home state of Maine for King. Well, that's about all the time we have today. Uh, but when it comes to seeing who's going to be the next president, somebody's definitely closer, and it's not Stephen King.